Hi, I am Laurie A. Barato and I am going to discuss about schistosomiasis. Schistosomiasis is caused by flukes which have complex life cycles involving specific freshwater snail species as intermediate hosts. Infected snails release large numbers of minute free-swimming larvae that are capable of penetrating the unbroken skin of the human host. Even brief exposure to contaminated fresh water such as wading, swimming, or bathing can result in infection. Human schistosomiasis cannot be acquired by wading or swimming in salt water. The circuit of birds and aquatic animals can penetrate the skin of human beings who enter infested fresh or salt water in many parts of the world, including cold temperate areas. The circuit die in the skin but may elicit a periodic rush. This infection is estimated to occur worldwide, affecting some 200 million persons. Schistosomiasis is most prevalent in Sub-Saharan Africa, Southern China, the Philippines, and Brazil. Clinical manifestations of acute infection can occur within 2 to 3 weeks of exposure to circuit infested water, but post-acute infections are asymptomatic. These are the signs and symptoms of schistosomiasis. Fever, lack of appetite, weight loss, abdominal pain, hematuria, weakness, headache, joint and muscle pain, diarrhea, nausea, and cough. The schistosomiasis can be prevented by number one. Avoid fresh water wading or swimming in rural areas of endemic countries. Number two, heating bathing water to 50 degrees Celsius or 122 Fahrenheit for five minutes or treating it with iodine or chlorine in a manner similar to the precautions recommended for preparing drinking water will destroy circuit and make the water safe. Number three, filtering water with paper coffee filters is also effective in removing circuit from bathing water. Number four, it is advisable to allow bathing water to stand for three days because circuit rarely survive longer than 48 hours. Number five, Vigorous towel drying after accidental exposure to water has been suggested as a way to remove circuit in the process of skin penetration. However, this may only prevent some infections and should not be recommended as a preventive measure. And last but not the least, those who might have been exposed to schistosome infested fresh water should be advised to undergo screening tests. Schistosomiasis can be treated by Praziquantel. It is a drug of choice for all species of schistosoma. Or it is also can be cured by a oxamniquine has been effective in treating infections caused by schistosoma mansoni in some areas where prosequentel is less effective. I hope you learned something from my presentation and that's all. Thank you. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. This song right here, this song right here, this song right here, it's that medicine, 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 med